New developments tonight in that incident last week in Whittier when a car plowed into a group of more than two dozen Sheriff's Department recruits. Now that driver's attorney says her client, Nicholas Gutierrez, fell asleep at the wheel while on his way to work. Meantime, one of those recruits has taken a turn for the worse. Alejandro Martinez now listed in grave condition. Eyewitness News reporter Carlos Granda has the latest. We're at UCLA Medical Center. Some family members related to other injured recruits tell Eyewitness News that they heard one recruit was being moved here from St. Francis Medical Center yesterday. According to the Sheriff's Department, one recruit, Alejandro Martinez, has suffered setbacks in his recovery that has left him in grave condition. Additional details about his injuries have not been released. Kevin Algarden is from the Sheriff's Relief Association. And these same young recruits now, whatever they, many of them had certain plans, those plans and the trajectory that they had planned has changed. Surveillance video shows the group of recruits running in tight formation along the side of the road when the vehicle plows into them. Algarten says some of these young men and women suffered horrific injuries, and that's why they're raising money to help in any way they can. Some have had amputations and very serious life-threatening injuries. Their need will most probably be much bigger than somebody else. The suspect, Nicholas Joseph Gutierrez, was arrested Wednesday on suspicion of attempted murder. He was released the following day as Sheriff Alex Villanueva says they are gathering more evidence to build a solid case to present to District Attorney George Gascon. Villanueva says statements made by the recruits and other witnesses who were at the scene have led the department to believe the crash was intentional. Gutierrez's lawyer, however, disagrees, saying it was a tragic accident. As the recruits heal, Algarten says the community has responded with overwhelming love and support. I was just talking with somebody from Training Bureau this morning, and the word we had was amazing. It has been amazing. Three other recruits are still in critical condition. The department says the rest have all been released from hospitals. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.